Hey guys, so this is a Bluetooth ketone uh, breathalyzer and uh, um, this one is made by a company called Ketonex and uh, um, very, very interesting product because I've been using this for a few years now. Um, they are pretty early onto the market for measuring of the, uh, the, the ketones in your breath. So you know if you're on keto diet, whether you're in ketosis or not. Um, this one, I'm just gonna show you guys really quick. So it comes in a few different pieces. Okay, so let me take everything out. And it comes in this little nice um, case over here. We have a few different versions, I believe, um, but this one is kind of nice to have because um, again, this one comes with a actually an integrated uh, battery, so you can use this everywhere, and it's pretty much just a uh, battery charger. So when the battery runs out, you plug in the uh, the micro USB cable to charge this this little battery piece, and then you'll be able to use it everywhere you like. Now, if you're just at home, they come with this adapter, USB adapter, so you don't have to use the battery. You can just use the adapter to connect directly to the actual uh, keto meter on the back. This is a USB insert, so you can plug it in here and then put it in any power source, okay? And then you can charge it. Um, it comes with two of those, uh, um, how do you call it, like mouthpiece. So if you have two people in the household that you want to use each mouthpiece individually, you can use them individually but it's just for me so i have one and then i have a backup over there the other one is rarely used on the mouthpiece there are a few holes that corresponds to when you actually put it on to the uh the breathalyzer there is a indentation over here so different holes uh, corresponds to different uh air um ex exertion speed so smaller hole you're gonna exert uh, you're gonna exert air a little bit slower when you you uh you blow into the machine and the larger hole you can um exhale much quicker okay so um the 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 um the actual metering mechanism is inside this mouthpiece mechanism here so i am just gonna plug it in to the battery since it's much easier and show you guys, you're gonna see a blue light when you put it in there, comes on. Hopefully it's got some battery charge, yep. So this blue light, when it's flashing, that means it's heating up the elements in here. And once it gets pretty heated up to the temperature that it's ready to measure, the light will actually turn into a solid blue. Then you know it's ready to measure. Um, there is an app on your phone that you need to pair this with um, the app to be able to use it. The app itself is called Ketonix. Okay, so you can download it from the App Store or Android uh, Android Store. And once you have that app installed, you can measure the ketone by blowing the air once the indicator turns a solid blue. Now, one thing to keep in mind is... Um, this thing is temperature sensitive. So if you're at a warmer climate, it's, it takes probably one to two minutes for this little light to turn solid. But if you're at a colder climate, say up north, and you don't have any heaters in your house, this light is gonna blink for at least 10, 15 minutes. So really you need to, to be at a warmer room or a warmer temperature to be able to get the sensor ready to use much, much faster, okay? So um, again, this is not a cheap product. I think it retails new for close to $200 for the whole set. Um, likely, I got it on eBay and it only cost me about $60 for, um, for this whole piece, okay? And uh, um, let's see. So I am just going to show you guys um, when the device gets ready, I'm going to make another video showing you what is going to be shown on the app of, of the phone and while I'm blowing um, 
through the mouthpiece into the, the device. Okay, so see you in the next section. Good morning, guys. So uh, this is actually the second day of the review. Um, yesterday, I wasn't able to hold the camera to show you guys what the reading is. So today, I have my wife help me and I have the Ketonix uh, breathalyzer connected to my PC using the traditional USB um, connection. And I'm gonna open up the app so when I blow through the uh, breathalyzer, my wife is able to uh, show you guys what's gonna be shown on the screen um, in the Ketonix uh, breathalyzer app. Okay, so right now, as you can see, it's solid blue. So that means it's the device is pretty much ready to measure. Uh, and this morning I had a like small cup of cappuccino, but I don't think that should affect my um, the ketone reading. So, but I'm curious to find out whether it's gonna affect it or not. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys the app. Again, this is the interface itself, and uh, this is the home page. So, the most important thing is to go to the measure page when this is solid solid blue go to the measure page and you hit connect let me see okay it's trying to connect so when it connects it flashes and it's pretty much ready to go and at this point i'm just gonna follow the instruction breathe breathe normally no deep inhalations and exhale most of the air into your out of your lung and then you continue to excel, and uh, the last bit of air is what you want to blow into the uh, the measuring area. Okay, so I'm just gonna breathe normally, and let's see if I can just hold it, and I'm gonna excel until all my airs are gone, and the last bit I'm gonna blow into the machine. When you finish blowing, just hit down, and it's gonna measure the actual ketones in parts per million uh, for you from your breath. And obviously this morning I'm doing great. My body is burning a lot of fat. So 20 parts per million, which is pretty much, you know, what you're supposed to see the results. It's gonna be like between eight to 20-ish. So that's, that's a really good result. And uh, I'm gonna save this result so once it's saved, it's gonna clear the gas in the chamber. And once it resets to zero, you can do another test if you want. But for me, I know I'm in keto, so I don't need to do another test. And uh, once you're done, you're gonna to come to analysis. And this is where you can see your measurements. Once you do it regularly, two times or like even three, four times a day, and you have a consistent data, you'll be able to monitor your ketone levels um, you know, from day to day, from month to month, or even like in, on a yearly basis. And in the other tabs, there are suggested workflow, uh, recipes, uh, diet, keto, keto calculator, whatever. Um, it just, this app, again, I, I find it really, really useful because it really helps me staying in keto. And sometimes if I'm, I'm splurging and I, I'm doing a lot of like, I, I, how do you call it? The cheat days, I eat a lot of carbs, I eat one piece of pizza, and then I still come back and I measure myself just to make sure I'm still in ketone or ketosis. Uh, so this app really helps me staying in keto quite a lot. And of course, your determination and your diet is also the most important thing to help you guys stay in keto. But uh, if you ask me whether the, the ketonics is worth it, I would say most definitely it's worth every cent. If you can find it used, it's actually, sometimes I think it's much better value for under $100 because the thing, this thing brand new, it's about $200 online, okay? And likely, I, luckily, I got it for $60 for the whole set of, you know, Bluetooth um, kit. Um, so that actually concludes this video. If you guys have any questions about the Ketonix um, breathalyzer for, um, keto diet, feel free to ask me in the comment section down below and I'll be happy to answer for you guys. And uh, thanks again for watching. Hope to see you in the next video. Take care.